Hi lovebirds, it's me Kim, back with another video for you. So, as I always say, welcome to another episode of Love Birds Life. And today I have a little mini seafood boil for you with some snow crab, yum, and some blue lip mussels, and some shrimp, scrimp, scrimp, scrimpity scrimp. Little scrimp, scrimpity scrimps. Little scrimps. You see that? You see it? Is it focusing? Yum, yum. Okay. So, and I have my lemons on deck. And I have my little concoction here of... Let me try to find a, a little way to... Of my butter dip. I've been, you know, mixing and doing a little experimenting with my butter because even though I do want to try Be Love sauce and I'm definitely going to try Job Queen. I'm going to try your sauce, girl. But I've been doing a little experimenting my own self, you know, because I know what I, I know what I like. So I've been, and so in this butter sauce, it's garlic, lemon, and um, Bahia, Bahia seasoning. So it's, so far it tastes good. Oh yeah, mm-hmm, oh, mm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna put up a copy of a screenshot of my DNA results right here. Okay, so in those DNA results, actually now that is my results from when they very when I very from the very first time I sent in my saliva sample. Ooh. But so um, let's see, I think back in October they gave me an update to October 2018 that gave me an update and it's like totally different okay and I have cousins that I know my cousins and you know of course we matched on our DNA test and I asked them I said did yours change <laughs> it was like freaking out and they're like yeah yeah mine changed too and I'm like okay so we still cousins <laughs> but so anyway so let's get into eating some of this first before I get to talking Mm. I already blessed my food, you guys. I'm, I'm starting to do it before. So, you know, save some of my battery time for now. Not just my battery time, but my memory card to save some space on my memory card. Because... You know how the memory cards get to acting. They want to act up on you. Some days. Uh oh. Yeah, I got that. This time I got my crackers. On deck. Got my crackers on deck. So, is it still cold where you guys are? Still cold where we are. We've gotten some freezing rain the other day. And, um, I'm telling you, it's been just cold. I'm ready for spring. I'm ready for spring. I know everybody is.
Today I got my little warmer to keep my food nice and hot. Let me tell you, I'm loving it. You don't have to pause and go overheat the butter. Because, <laughs> you know, how sometimes you get to talking. And while you're talking, your food just, you know, cold and stuff. Who likes that? I don't know. So I want to give her a name. What should we call her? I know Casey calls hers Bertha. And Mama D calls hers. Oh, what do you call yours? Raphael? Jose? I forgot. Because <laughs> you just named him. If I recall. But anyway, if I give her a name. For now, she little mama, because she little. I hope everyone's been having a great week. Nice fun week. Fun week staying warm. <laughs> I see some people have been going out and sledding, taking advantage of that snow. Snow is so fun. It's just not fun when you got to work in it. Got to go to work, drive in it. Crazy people don't know how to drive in it. I'm one of them. Still hate to drive in that type of weather. Mm -hmm. No lobster for you guys today. I have it. I just didn't want to cook it. Didn't feel like it. Didn't feel like lobster. I'll give it to you guys next time. Okay. It's so sweet. Yes. And this butter just sets everything apart. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm not gonna mess around and have all that butter running down my chin through the whole video. Nobody tell me. We're not gonna play that game today, okay? These are cracking really good today. Look at that. Ha! Ah. Ooh, where are you going? Wow. Yeah. Mm -mm. Here, take a bite. Good. Yeah. Take yourself a bite. <laughs> All right. I'm good. Oh, I didn't put no butter on it for you. Sorry. I'm going to drip in. You know how messy you guys get. Mmm. Mmm. That's so good. You know it's good when you eat this part. Uh, hey. I need to push this closer to you guys, so. My 
butter right underneath me. There we go. That's probably going to be a thumbnail, guys, because I sure forgot to take one. Muscle. A little yummy garlic in it. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to happen. Bit my tongue again, guys. Make sure you get it good because last time I was wiping my chin and it's too. It was still there and nobody told me. Get some towel. Get my cat and she's eating. One of my kitties. I want to be able, I want to try getting my videos up in the afternoons. It's around lunchtime for some states. It's right after school, right after work. Inspire people to luncheon or inspire their dinners. Who knows? I know I watch and get inspired on what to eat. Oh man. Oh, that's a sweet one too. Sometimes I just don't need the butter. I like to be able to taste my seafood. My crab legs are stuck so away. Those two big boys up there. Good job. I'm so 
so much garlic. Who else just loves garlic? Now you act right. Ooh. Oh yeah. I feel like I got something. Maybe that'll be my thumbnail. <laughs> Who knows? You guys, I could eat seafood every day. I love it. I don't feel as heavy. That's cool. Well, don't get me wrong. Seafood will fill you up. It's just you don't stay full. Little babies. I don't like the little thing just sticking up there. I'll just take them out. Little skeleton. Mm, come on. This cluster, this one here. I don't know if this was a good cluster. Mm. Finger looking good. Finger looking good. I don't really even need my lemons. Piece of shrimp here. Let that lemon rain. Lemon rain. Oh shoot, I should have sucked it off first, huh? Psh. seeds. Do like you guys do. I'll be watching. I'll be watching. Yeah, it does hold all the Pieces in there. But by the time I finish sucking it all out, you gotta dip it again. I don't know how long I've been on. Yeah. Trying to do go fast for you guys, but my it is. You know how it is. I don't have more shrimp over here. Everyone who knows me knows I love shrimp. Especially my noodles. Oh my goodness. Shrimp and the noodles. Dang. My noodles. Mr. C, I know you know you're not going to be up in there. Mm. 
Mm, okay. And down to nitty gritty, folks. Oh, nice crispy shell. Come on, come on. You can do it. Here you go. So satisfying. Even though it came out all tender. <laughs> mm. 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 Taste what I'm tasting. Time for the messy part of the. Look at, see that? And it's so flaky. It's hard to eat. I think I just got a little message. Tell me. That my battery. Not my battery. I just put a brand new battery in. But everything else is about to cut off on me. Play around. It needs to just be. So you guys will get this video this afternoon, hopefully, because I don't know about you guys, but sometimes my upload speed is slow, real slow. I mean, I get it. My videos tend to be a little long, but dang, I don't be that dang slow. I realize my, you know, I got that little line in my chin. <laughs> it be catching the oil too. <laughs> mm. Okay, so I know you guys are ready to get into this DNA test. Baby claw open. <laughs> you little suckers. This is what people be talking about when they be saying, those snow crabs are too much work. They good, baby. They good. Especially when they sweet. Succulent. Oh my god. They good. Alright, now I know most of this is you know, so flaky.
Why didn't wipe some sticking it in the but don't worry about it. Miss Casey, my sister. Got me saying that. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's all good. Did I get you guys? Did I get my love birds? Get you in the eye. Well, if he's still here, <laughs> waiting. I feel like it. I'm gonna fast forward. But that part's gonna be an after party, people. Because you can't be sitting up there talking and trying to eat. But your food gets cold. I might have to turn little mama back up. lately you know save the earth use less paper towels okay okay makes sense to me because <laughs> the garlic is just everywhere I think I may have used I'm using too much garlic you think I don't know you tell me you guys are smart okay let's do this Over there, all that over there, over there, over there. My towel might be a little too greasy. Okay, and drink some water. I'm gonna put it up again for you guys to refresh you since I put it up in the very beginning so you guys probably forgot okay unless you screenshot it or whatever anyway so the my ethnicity estimate so it says here that I am 39% Benin Togo 27% Cameroon Congo and Southern Bantu peoples I am 14% English from Wales and Northwestern Europe. So where is that? I'm going to tell you in a little bit. 7% Ivory Coast in Ghana. 5% Native American, North, Central, and South. Okay. 4% Mali and 4% Nigerian. Now, on my original, let's see, view previous estimate. On the original one, I was 40% Nigerian, 13% Benin Togo, 12% Ivory Coast Ghana, 9% Cameroon, Congo, and Southern Matu, Bantu peoples. That's a big difference from 9% to, I think, what, 27% now? And then only 
English, Wales, and Northwestern Europe. I was 5% Iberian Peninsula, 3% Native American, 3% Mali, 3% Asia Central, 2% Senegal. Ooh, I love Senegal people. But I'm not I'm not part of that that culture anymore. Since the update. 1% Europe East. 1% Africa, South Central Hunter Gathers. A little bit of Scottish, Wales, Ireland. Okay guys, sorry about that. My memory card got full. So anyway, I'm just going to go over these with you real quick. I am looking at the updated estimate and it is compared to my last estimate. And so we have the Benin Togo, 39%, and that was increased by 26%. My Cameroon, Congo, and Southern Bantu peoples at 27%. That was increased by 18%. England, Wales, and Northwestern Europe is at 14%. That was increased by 8%. Ivory Coast, Ghana is at 7%. That was decreased by 5%. Native American, North Central, South refined from Native American, 3%. Well, before it was 3%. And it's at, no, I think it was before, yeah, before it was at 3%. Now it's at 5%. So that's, it went up, I guess, 3%. And Mali, maybe not so much common, but very popular. Um, so anyway, so that decreased by 36%. So I'm only 4% Nigerian to my Nigerian people. Sorry. And then um, the rest of this is just explaining what reference samples are and how they use them. So what it says is reference samples are DNA samples from regions around the world that they compare your test results against to calculate your ethnicity estimate. And the more samples means better ethnicity results. So people get out there and have your DNA tested because, you know, it helps us all. It helps us all, especially people of color, African-Americans who were, you know, we know, our, we know our history, right? So, okay, guys, that's the end of that. I'm having so much fun with this DNA, finding interesting family members that I never knew existed. And so, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so, so, so much.